Hi Capricorn, welcome to this Tower Love reading. My name's Sophia. So Capricorn, I wasn't feeling a great energy, I'll be totally honest with you. It was quite dark. So you could be around quite negative people and they're draining you. Like they're known as um, energy vampires, but I feel it's not their literally like for example you're at work and they're putting a load of work on you and the boss is on your case to do all this work i feel it's literally negative people you're, you're not you're you're you do know they're dark they're dark you know dark people it could be literally depressed people it could be people that um i don't know it's it's different than someone actively being on your case of work like a really um a mum that's dark it's dark people it's a dark energy and i feel like i would say it's you but i feel it's going into you very interesting it's not interesting but it's like like i wouldn't say i would literally because i'm that blatant say listen i feel you're dark you need to work on yourself but it's not that i feel you're around or something that's around you that's dark and it's manifesting with inside of you. That's what I was getting. And I don't normally have readings like this. But um, this might resonate with a small. But hopefully you're open in your eyes. If this is you. And you can see who it is. Work on yourself and release it. Uh, there is a lot of darkness out there at the moment. So it's easy to catch the dark. Let's just say. Right. Just like you catch a cold. <laughs> slash COVID. You catch the dark. Right. If you're around someone who's just negative negative nancy or something like that i don't know i don't know but it's um and i feel it's affecting you because you're so light because you're a light worker you can't be around these negative situations that's why they're isolated that's why light workers have twin flames for life which that contract's ended but um because you can't be around people that's why there's such a heightened connection it fulfills you ten of cups so you don't need others because if there's something around you that is dark and you're the light this is taking your light literally so i don't know what that is so let's see if the cards say anything very i don't normally have readings like that and let's see how it could be your person i don't know because this is this is love readings right i do love readings so let's see what's going on here um it could be look two of cups here um check out the facebook I, I'm, I'm too tired to go into that details i'll be honest with you i do extra readings but i normally do a long spill just go there it is look the devil like i said i think i'm getting the devil i don't know the darkness and like i said it's love like it's taking your light anyway let's jump in eight of wands you might have some kind of communication about this from upstairs i mean eight of wands it's like tower moments to me eight of wands two of cups nine of wands so the eight of wands is um to me like you're having tower moment tower moment keep away don't get pulled in detach tower moments stuff keeps happening that you keep getting pulled in and it's something to do with it could be baby's mom baby's dad to do with children with the two of cups like your baby's dad could be a nightmare the devil right and when i say the devil not literally but dark and that's why twin flames are separating because the feminines are going to get pulled into the masculine's darkness and with such light it's now transforming transferring over to that so it's very important to keep away from this kind of negative don't get pulled in is what i'm going to say here because to me, this two of cups is to do with you You engaging with someone who's very dark. It doesn't have to be the twin flame. This could be an ex. Like my, my ex-husband has got my daughter. He's dark. Right? He's not my twin flame, no. My, uh, my, my, yeah, my children's dad, right? Very negative. There's something you can be around a narcissistic, all that kind of thing. And it's draining you. Nine of Wands is, is like they're trying to communicate to you about it. 
that you're a star seed. Can you see the star? And it's like defend yourself. I don't know what to say. Defend yourself from the moon, right? This darkness is trying to take your light with the sun. You need the strength to defend your end this cycle. I know it's a different site uh, reading, but at the end of the day, all my readings are about love. If you have this, this is blocking your heart, two of cups, your emotions. Two of cups is one cup and then the other person is cup, mutual love. If you've got all this darkness and the devil, you, they, you, it blocks your heart and you can't attract love. This is a love reading, right? So whatever I say, this is like connected to love anyway. So this is very important. You need to have the strength to defend yourself and end this nightmare situation. Ten of Swords. What, look, I don't even have the moon card. Uh, the moon card is here. This is something. Shadow work to remove it. Um, getting the strength. Taking a pause. And stop getting emotionally involved. And like I said, this the moon is the mother. Right? So you could be a mother of a narcissistic. And that's once again why the twin flame contract ended. Because the divine masculines are, uh, are literally turning narcissistic. Right? I used to call it narcissistic traits. But if you're manipulating someone with children, with having loads of children, and all this kind of thing, and just having children just because you're shagging, because you're not working on your sexual abuse, the child is birthed from that. So that's why this is, the, the whole contract is ended. And this is like, uh, like I said, the mother. You're, it's, it's definitely um, someone who you're connected. It could be your person's mum. Something to do with mum here. Your mum, so your partner, your ex-partner, your twin flame, devil. Toxic, has a toxic pattern here that is stabbing you in the back. Constant stabbing you in the back, right? And people say Ten of Swords is ending. No. The end card is the death card, right? When you die, that's it. Finished, right? Even the world card, you can keep having new circles. And even the death card can come around again, right? Because you reincarnated, right? So tens are not really ending. You can constantly, unless you have the strength, but right? you need the strength to protect yourself because this could be constant, this Ten of Swords is what I'm trying to say here. Very important, this reading, because it will stop you from love. This devil energy, right, inside of you will stop you from attracting love. And I feel with the Eight of Wands, you're doing good anyway. But they're trying to tell you, stop getting pulled in to this darkness. I told you, the moon is dark. Their community someone's telling you or you're getting downloads stop getting pulled into the darkness let's get additional cards here new love yeah this will absolutely affect your new love unless you don't get a handle on it right and a new person is coming in oh who has stirred your romantic interest but with this other situation you don't want this darkness there with this new love that's coming in. Oh, I've got to take them. Oh my gosh. Like I said, you're a light worker, a giver of light. This person's taking your light. I don't know, the cards are what they've got to say, right? Trinity. Gone through a rebirth. Mm. Like I said, I feel you're working on yourself. So the more you're working on yourself, the more this narcissistic person, and I don't say that gently, right? Because I don't like tower readers who just put labels on. But I damn well know that the twin flame contract has ended because of the masculines are going overboard, right? Too narcissistic. So I feel you've gone through a rebirth, Trinity, what's it got on the back? Gone through a rebirth, right? And but you're more light, giver of light, so more dark. They're getting more dark. Foundation, tower. You need to start again, ten of swords. Move your foundation, whatever you got to do, right? 
because the devil can uh, is, is um, can be hardcore, right? Because the devil is um, people think eight of wands is uh, eight of pentacles is hard work, Capricorn is hard work. So to remove the devil is hard work, right? Once that's in you, once that's around you, the darkness. Because Capricorn are hard workers. So it would be extremely hard work to remove it once. So this is why this is like move, change your foundation, eat healthy. Once the devil's a darkness is around you and then you're eating McDonald's and crap food, that's feeding the devil. It's very important. This is a different reading, but, you know, I've got to say what I've got to say. Commitment. They're bringing you new love and commitment so that you work on, you come away from the old. 100% so you don't get pulled in. It's probably why you've got a new person. So you don't get pulled in. Because they're like, you're working on yourself very well. Don't get pulled into it. And let's end it out with one of these. Exploration. Yeah, this, this reading is definitely, if you understand, this is about seeing it differently exploration is like you might know your pers your baby's dad or something is a narcissistic right or a nightmare or always you know cheating or playing toxic drunk whatever but this is, is exploring how that negative is affecting you properly well how i said that devil energy but if you watch tarot they say this is the energy and energy is as within so without so if you're around someone who's negative, you're you're literally, and you're the light, right? You go into a dark room and you open the door to another dark room, you can't tell where what is dark. You put on a light a match in a massive dark room, you can see that light. All the darkness, right? Then you see the light. That's what this is. And this card of exploration is be open to listening to this reading and understanding what's happening. It's more deeper with the moon card of what you think it is very important you understand you must cut off foundation here tower card that must crumble ending this stabbing in the back all the drama ending it there's uh, look at that the, the probably the two most worst cards in the deck devil ten of swords together you must end it right because you're doing well working on yourself right Okay, I'm out. If you need help with that and counselling, book me. Speak to you later.